everybody flash your eyes on here with another demo from the recent uh, Steam Next Fest. Today we're looking at Poly Skies. Poly Skies is a casual village builder and colony sim designed to help you relax, take care of your villagers who are seeking refuge from dangers below the clouds. And it's due for release in summer of 2020. Right? Uh, obviously it's a demo version so things might not work, there might be bugs, as long as we remember that we'll be fine. Okay, right, let's just dive in. I'm not like I'm going this purely not looked at it at all, so we're, we're basing it together for, together for the first time. <clears throat> the land beneath has been overrun by monsters up here in the clouds, so we are safe for now at least. As you build, you will need more villagers to expand, find, or trade new villagers at the end of every week when airships arrive. You can unlock. You can unlock new building tiers by gaining more villages. Keep track of the 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 master the, of this in the master panel. Tier one builders have been unlocked, so we'll okay you and we'll okay you. Okay, any kind of tutorial? Nope, don't look like it. So, put your arm away. Pour it. <coughs> right, so if I go, that's just go. Okay, so build community resources defense. So if I go and we want to build a. As a three villagers, so if I kind of put you, rotate you, put you there, let's build another one of these then, next to it, so these higher, I've got a second there, and you up, this goes a bit awkward, okay, so how do you pause it? Can you pause it? Milestones, villager list, options. Okay. We have six villagers, so these hold. Place to relax. Uh, resources. Uh, storage, gross food, fishery, collecting wood. Okay, so let's have a farm. Place a farm there. It would be nice if you gave us a tutorial. I do like my tutorials, and this isn't given us one. I wish you could. I wish you could also line up the houses as well. But hey, hey, hell. Okay. Okay, building. Okay, building tier. Okay. Got six villagers. Okay. <coughs> what can we build? Resources, defense. Okay. Watch for threats. Resources. Collecting wood, so put you kind of. I'll put you in the corner there. Okay. You're gonna do that. You're gonna do that. Let's do a lot of storage. Once I've storage, put let's kind of put the storage here. Okay. Uh. So how many villages have we got? Villager list. We've got. Got six villagers, okay, milestones, okay, uh, okay, farm there, so, so ah, right, I need to allocate workforce to them, ooh, okay, okay, that makes sense, okay, machine we'll have to do over there, that's a maxi that, now your storage barn, uh, Okay. Oh, that makes sense. Okay. Oh, okay. So what workforce now is still six. It's okay. Oh, okay. So. Hmm. Uh, oh, could be. So there's a moment in time. What are you? Oh, I'm mooring. Oh, okay. Cool. So we've got that. We've got for nine village. Let's put another house down because let's see what did this cost resources to put down. I'm just slapping this down without any kind of look at yeah, they take 50 wood. Okay, we're not doing any more of that. I wish you could, I wish you could line them up a bit more because that looks a bit kind of all over the place. Okay, a trade ship will arrive at the end of the week. I wonder, how, I wonder if you can make it go faster. A hey, speed time up. Okay. Is it because if I go minus there, 
Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Everybody's happy. But it doesn't appear, you don't appear to be able to speed up time. Okay. Options. Game. Nope. There is music, but I've muted it just because... I don't copy that strike someone have you. Okay, well I can't click on that now. Is it because it's night? Uh, catch fish for food. Okay, you got work for us. Okay. <coughs> so I've got no way to ooh, let's have what else we can see. Only if you can look below the clouds. So, of course, we've got plenty of islands around, so I'm assuming we have to colonise colonize these islands. Can we get below the clouds? No, you can't. So, we've got no way of speeding up time. Or, they've all got people in them. We've still only got six people, so they're kind of moving in different houses. Okay. So, we're now just kind of like, okay. Uh, yeah, there's not a lot for you to do in the night then. So you can't speed up time, I don't think. So you're going to wait for the night to pass. Okay. Yeah, I don't... Yeah, well, you, know, you can't speed up time, which you could. So wait for the night to pass. I said, watch everybody come out to work again. And we'll see what the airship brings us. There you go, stupid to see what they look like. They're gonna do that. You really could do you really could do with an ability to be able to speed up time. That would help tremendously. If you could speed up time. So we've got six villages down here. We've got no gold. We've got why are they there? That something's there. Metal in storage. Crystal in storage, food's coming through the storage, wood's coming through, we've got plenty of stang. Ah, oh, okay. So at the moment, there's nothing we can build here. We can build more villages, no point in doing that. that is connects islands. Oh! Now, what do we need? I'm assuming we have to unlock that, that gets unlocked. So you're going to take stuff over to storage. <clears throat> now, I wonder how much, I wonder how much this storage can take. And what the capacity of the storage is. Hmm, it'd be interesting if we knew that. So at the moment we can just sit and watch. Yeah, one, I'd like to be able to speed up time because at the moment, this moment in time is not like I can do. So at the time we're just watching these villages go. So it would be good if we could speed up time. It's the first one. I'd like to, I'd like to know why, why I can't build that and when I can build it and what it does. A place to relax. Okay, can we click on the villages then? Working. You can highlight the villages, but it doesn't necessarily tell you anything about them. Okay. Okay, fine. Or oh, controls, that's what it look at. Controls. Nope. Okay, nothing to see there. It is only a demo, so you bear that in mind. I'm assuming that's I'm getting tired, you would assume. We'll see what happens when they hit, when their bar hits red. When it gets filled, when it fills out, I wonder, I wonder if that's um, getting tired as it as the work through the day. Food's getting stored anyway, so we're not going to starve. Let's click on this bloke. I want to see. I wonder if that means he is. See, he's just gone back. So I'm assuming. I'm, I'm assuming that is. Either the hunger, yeah, because they've taken food, right, I get it. That must be their hunger bar, because I think that icon is a food icon. So when they hit red, that means they're hungry. So they're gonna, they go to storage, collect food, and then go back to us and eat it and go back to work. I think that's how it seems to work. Yeah, there's a, there's, it's in, there's a lot of waiting for things to happen. There's a lot of waiting for things to happen. There's a moment in time, I've got nothing I can build. We can build another. We can build another. We can build another farm. 
Let's stack another form next to that. Might as well, so max workforce out on that. Yeah, I wish you could speed up time because that's what I'd like to be able to do is make this go a bit quicker. Because at the moment, yeah, at the moment in time, I'm just waiting for things to happen now. It's an interesting, interesting basic, basic little game. So I'm assuming what we'll do is we'll portal over to one of these other towns. I wonder, I wonder what these crystals do. I wonder what the point of these crystals are. Yeah, I have no clue what the crystals do. How are we? How far away are we from unlocking tier two? And what do we need to do? All right, <clears throat> two points, no, some points, observations. What do I need to do to get from tier one to tier two? I need, I'd like to know. I'd like to be told that what I need to do. I'd like to be able to speed up time because I don't like games where night time nothing happens because you literally just stand watching things happen. Three. I've built this and now I've got nothing to do. I'm literally just waiting for I'm waiting for it to get to daytime. I'm waiting for this to happen. It's just kind of like yeah, I mean I've built this lot and I'm now just sitting around waiting for things to happen so that I can then move on to the next phase. Yeah, I mean yeah, it's it's an interesting little game, but also what does, what do crystals do? What, I'd like to know what crystals do. What do I need them for? What's the point of them? Yeah. You need to. You need to need. You need to be. Able to, you, you need to be able to do. You need to have some things to do while you're waiting for daytime. Because at the moment, we're literally, we are stood here waiting for daytime. We're waiting for this trade to ship to come. Yeah. Yeah. Again, Port Love to the Islands. Great. But the thing as well is, <clears throat> I want to know. What the what's the, what is the point of this and how do I unlock it? What do I do to unlock this? Well, that's obvious. A lot. There's just three villages, so I've got enough for twelve villages. That's not a problem. Okay. We've got food. Food's coming through. That's great. Plenty of wood. I'd like to know what crystal. Would, what we need the crystal for? Yeah. So there's a lot. It, yeah. You need you need tool tips to tell you what these do and what you need to do to unlock them. And you, and I, I I don't I generally don't like games when the games that have day night cycles, where on the day night cycle on the night cycle you have physically, literally got nothing to do. Right, okay, I'm just waiting for this. Uh, I wait for this airship to come through at the end of the week. You need to be able to speed through time. You really need to be able to make this time go quicker because I've built everything I can build and there's nothing else I can do to kind of. There's nothing to do other than wait for the night for it to come. I wonder whether the crystals is what you need to the portals to connect the connect the uh connect everything together. And that's what we need the portals for. To connect the different islands together. But why not just use airships? I'm just guessing, I'm just going to guessing. They're all going back to work. Okay. The airship will be here soon enough. Yeah, we are literally waiting for the airship to come. Everybody's working. We're producing food. We can't defence. We can't work shift. We can't build a watch post. Because again, why can't I build that? Is that a different tier building? Yeah. Again, we can't build anything here. I'm assuming these are next level buildings. I like the fact that you can see the hunger bar. Yeah, it's. I like the concept, but there's a lot of things it's missing. There's a lot of waiting around for. There's a lot of waiting around for. The next thing to happen. I mean, there's a lot of waiting around. I mean, we've been playing now for, fifty just, just short about just around fifteen minutes, and for the for about, for about ten of those minutes, I've been literally stood here, kind of. I've 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 been sat here waiting for uh, things to happen. Yeah, so it's interesting, but again, needs more. Okay, so we are literally waiting for the airship to come. I'd also like to know is what do I need to do to get to that next tier. What and what you need, what I need to do. 
didn't really tell you. There's, there's, yeah, it, I know it's only a demo, but it, it, it need, needs to be more. You need more information. You need, you need, <coughs> you, need you need more stuff to do because at the moment we've done everything in the first five minutes of the of the coming into the game, and now I'm literally just kind of sat here watching it tick over, which is no fun really. It's a bit boring really. I'm being, I'm probably a bit harsh. Because it's only a demo, but relaxing city. But I'm, I'm literally just, wa I'm literally watching the game play itself. Basically, you need to be, you need to be able to speed up time. Oh, okay, so again, let's wait for the airship. Let's see whether this airship comes. I like, I like the idea. I like the idea. I like the idea of you hiding from the surface because monsters are around. You know, I like that, and I'd like to more idea of what those monsters are, where they've come from, and why they're and why they've taken over. Day three, week one, trade ship will arrive at the end of each week. So, so a week lasts three days. I'm looks of it. Okay, and again, one to day night cycle. Also, how much again? How much storage do? We, We've got storage one. How do I know what it's full? Is it infinite? Is it an infinite storage barn? How many of these do I need? Yeah, again. There's a lot of just kind of waiting for things to happen. So far, I'm not overly, I guess I'm not overly impressed. Be honest with you, I'm not overly impressed. I like the concept. I like the concept, but there's just a lot of. It's very basic. There's there's not a lot of gameplay in it. There's not a lot of. It looks really looks nice, but it's not a lot. There's not a lot of gameplay. I mean, it's kind of. I could I could spam my houses, but it, the houses are water the water, but you don't. You don't really build time, you don't have kind of things happening, you just kind of I built this lot in the first four or five minutes and now I'm just kind of what sat here waiting for things to happen. So week two The trade ship had the trade ship didn't arrive, it was meant to it was meant to the trade ship was a trade thing was meant to arrive and it didn't. Okay, I've built a more in. I've got more in here. Also you cocked a Kenneth at night either. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have, I think I've seen it enough, to be honest with you. Yeah, it's... I don't know what to say, really. It's just kind of... It's okay, but there's not a lot to see in it. There's not an awful lot to do. You've got... I have got zero clue how to how to get to the next milestone. That didn't appear. The trade ship didn't appear, so I've no idea how that works. There's not an awful lot to do. There's not. There's not a lot to do. You kind of just waiting for the. Here, here it comes. Here it comes. Sorry, game. I was been harsh on you then. So he's going to arrive. So what is he going to bring this? He's going to arrive there. Trade. So we can trade. Pay transportation fee to accept new villages. So we can't. So we need to sell. So we need to sell some, what we got, let's sell some stone, shall we? So, right, so, hang on, so let's work out, so if we go, let's, let, if we go, right, so if that costs, each villager could, each village costs 10, so I want, if I go, let's just go, let's go, let's go 12 villages. Accept 12 villages. Oh, we've now unlocked that. Okay, interesting. Accept. Okay. Okay, so I've now got that. Okay, he's, we've now got 18 villages. So I've now got, so I need to build some more houses for said villages. So now we can now unlock that. So if I now kind of pop you there. That's three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen. 
and these things are auto built they're automatically populated build a build, build little street there campfire there we've now got lots more things open to us so let's see you get this population let's max you out and let's put we've got fishery again I've got mine. What are you? You are a quarry. Where can you go? Quarry. And this almost like we've placed them. Let's put another another farm down. Why don't let me put that down? Oh, we haven't got enough wood. Ew, interesting. Okay. So that's now pop up what says max out workforce so you take six you take five campfire do i need to work on a campfire is it because i'm is it let me take so if i take can sit down to three two okay okay so 18 villages Okay, so I've got quite a walk out with everybody. So working, gone fishing. So I've got how many people got house? How many people have we got housekeeping then? This could this could be easier to use as well. We've got one housekeeping, so let's go to quarry. Let's stick one in quarry. So now we've got now we've got more people. Okay. So if I now go to defence, can't do that. Uh, is it here? So where do you go on now? Oh, we need that so I know we need that, don't we? So if I come out of this so if I go to trade and I'm gonna and I want oh, well, I don't want to do that actually. I didn't want to do that. If I want to buy some of that, accept, cancel, go to here, go to here. Now where do they go? Because right in the middle, because in the middle, okay, interesting. That's in place in a certain place, does it? Does placement matter? Uh, 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 star, I'll grab it, star, go right smack in the middle, and that'll do. Okay. Villages, one way trip to, to the other side, okay. But again, okay, so. How do how do you use it? How do you use it though? I built this thing, but how do I actually physically use it? He's off. He's off. So how do I actually physically use it? Because surely you got one on the other side, surely. Yeah. Built it, but how do you actually physically use it? Okay. Yeah. In, uh, but again now I've done everything we've built everything we're now just kind of sat around waiting for the next thing to happen for the next milestone yeah let me know if you've played the demo let me know what you think about it again I like the concept but it just kind of I wish you could I wish you could line up the snap line them a bit more but I'm just a little, again I'm a little bit kind of well there's not a lot, there's not a lot happening really there's not a lot awful lot happening. Anyway, yeah, thanks for that. thanks for watching. Yeah, it's nah, I'm torn on this. I like the look of it. I like the concept, but just it needs a lot more work for you before it's finished off. A lot more work because there's so many things. So as I already covered, so many things it needs it needs adding to it to make it complete. And there needs to be more to do. Again, we're now just kind of sat here waiting for the trade ship to come. But anyway. Thanks very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. And if you've played it, you let me know what you think about it. And anyway, thanks very much for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks very much. Bye.